you ever been asked the question, do you have a personal relationship with Jesus Christ? I know I have. And the answer to that question for every Christian, every Catholic should be a resounding yes. However, what's interesting about that question is that if you go to the actual pages of the Bible itself, you'll never find the expression personal relationship anywhere in the pages of Scripture. That's not a biblical expression. It's more of a tradition about how to express the relationship that we have with God in Christ. When you turn to the pages of the Bible itself, you'll find that it describes the relationship between Christ and the church not just as a personal relationship, but as a covenant, a marriage covenant between Christ the bridegroom and the church as his bride. In this presentation, Jesus the Bridegroom, the greatest love story ever told. I try to show you what that means to say that Christ is the bridegroom and the church is the bride, and that the relationship between them is really a marriage, a marriage covenant. By going back to the very beginning of time and showing why the Bible begins with a wedding, the wedding of Adam and Eve in the Garden of Eden, and it ends with a wedding, the wedding of Christ and the church in the book of Revelation and how everything in between Genesis and Revelation, from the Old Testament accounts of the Exodus from Egypt, the prophecies of the Messiah, all the way to the New Testament accounts of Jesus' mysterious wedding at Cana miracle, of his mysterious teachings about the bridegroom, and above all, of his passion and death on the cross, how all of these things, all of these events of salvation history, are nothing less than the divine love story of a God who wants to enter into a marriage covenant with the human race, with his people, of Christ the Messiah, who's not just the Son of God, but a bridegroom in love with his bride, the church. So if you've ever wanted to understand the mystery of Christ's passion for the church, of his suffering in love for the church, then I invite you to come with me on this journey of discovery into what it really means to have a personal relationship with Jesus Christ, the Bridegroom Messiah of our souls.